Hello, my name's Peter Burrows. I'm from Towing and Trailers Limited. I'm going to go through uh, choosing the correct jockey wheel. Uh, and a few pointers on where to go and to try and make sure that you don't get the incorrect one that doesn't fit. In the UK, there are four reasonably popular sizes. There is the smallest uh, jockey wheel. This is what's known as a 34 mil jockey wheel. The 34 mil is the diameter of the shaft. And uh, these are the lightest duty jockey wheels currently going. Um, this particular one uh, in has just been launched in 2019 by Maypole. They are a cheap and cheerful jockey wheel. They are lightweight built and they are suitable for small trailers. Uh, personally, I wouldn't put them on anything larger than a 500 kilo capacity trailer. Um, there are more heavy duty versions of the 34 mil. Manufacturers like Knot do still make them and they make them out of thicker material with larger wheels, etc. Uh, but they do cost more and if you're paying more, I would uh, and uh, you're fitting a fresh jockey wheel, I would look at going for a larger diameter as this shaft isn't as strong. Um, moving up, the next size is a 42 mil. Uh, this one is a knot jockey wheel and it is the sort of thing that you would use on a trailer up to about two tons. Um, has a larger wheel, has a 200 by 50 wheel um, and it will fit couplings such as old Bradley, um, uh, sorry, all Bradley HU3 couplings take this, uh, some of the older HU5, HU6 will also have a hole through the coupling to take this and in dispension used to use it on up to 2.7 ton couplings uh, they stopped doing that around 2010 and upgraded to 48 mil there is a limited number of jockey wheels uh, available for heavy duty use uh, there seems to be a knot an indispension a bradley and a new company uh, called cart who have an orange handle um, these are yeah these are the sort of jockey wheels that i would use on a, a couple a trailer with a bradley hu3 coupling you can get cheaper lightweight duty lighter duty uh jockey wheels like your maypole but i always try and steer clear of that then there's the 48. This isn't a particular heavy duty one, this is more of a caravan jockey wheel. Uh, the reason that it's good for a caravan is it has a wide wheel. A lot of people tend to want pneumatic wheels, however pneumatic wheels, the tyres don't last five minutes. They, they go flat, they tear off the rim, they, they have even been known to uh, to just burst when they get warm uh, so if you're wanting something for soft ground etc you would go for a wheel with a wide frame like this this particular jockey wheel is the sort of thing that you would see on a single axle caravan it's a fairly light construction but it's nice for gravel drives, soft ground, etc. There are all the main manufacturers make a various 48 mil jockey wheels. Uh, it's one of the most popular. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, in dispension uh, since 2010 have used the 48 mil clamp in all. On, on all their couplings cast into the uh, 
frame itself. Uh, they've used it on three and a half ton all the time. Bradley have used it on the HU12 three and a half ton coupling uh, for a long time. The 48 mil clamp. Uh, they also use it on their European range. Not as only ever used 48 mil clamps on their couplings. And Alco, if they have a clamp, it is usually 48 mil. This isn't particularly a good one for a heavy trailer. I've just picked this to demonstrate the wide wheel, but you can buy smooth and ribbed. You can buy longer shafts uh, than this. Um, you can buy all sorts of manufacturers. Uh, everyone that I've mentioned making the 42 mil uh, makes the 48 mil and they are a nice heavy duty wheel. If you're on three and a half ton, I tend to go for the ribbed or serrated uh, jockey wheels um, as they are stronger and a lot more up to the job. Um, the, some of the better smooth ones, um, the, the, the knot ones, the cart ones, I would happily use those on a trailer up to 2.7 ton. But when you get over that, look at the ribbed ones. Ribbed ones are also available with wider wheels. Then, not too popular in the UK, but for serious use, you can go up to 60 mil. Um, 60 mil serrated. Uh, this is actually a 63 by Bradley. Um, not make a 60 mil with a larger wheel. Uh, these are for serious work. This has this will this particular jockey wheel will accept a nose weight of 750 kg, which is more than uh, any coupling. Any overrun coupling on a trailer is designed to take. This is normally used on uh, machine stuff for transporting machines, etc where weights alter when it's unloaded. Uh, they use them a lot on cable reel trailers. There is a smooth version around which tends to be used on the continent. We don't see much of the 60 mil smooth, but these, the 60 mil is when you get into serious heavy duty. Uh, and it's very rare in the UK that you tend to use this sort of size jockey wheel. But if you're having problems with jockey wheels failing, this is the one to look at read the description below we've got uh links to all the sizes of jockey wheels to be able to purchase them uh also we can do variations of clamps through all the sizes we can do them impressed or cast and we have a selection of prop prop stands for the rear of trailers uh that will fit uh the same clamps also available